In an open feed water heater for a steam plant, saturated steam at 7 bar is mixed with subcooled liquid at 7 bar and 25 C. Uh, the properties are shown here for that. Just enough steam is supplied to ensure that the mixed steam leaving the heater will be saturated liquid at 7 bar when heater efficiency is 95%. Let's call that N. Calculate the mass flow rate of the subcooled liquid if the steam flow rate is 0.865 kilograms per second. Let's call that our MS. 0.865 kilograms per second. And we are trying to find the mass flow rate of our subcooled liquid also in kilograms per second. So we will draw this problem so that we can understand it better. This is our open feed water heater. This is where the steam is going in. This is where the subcooled liquid is going in. And since this is an, this is an open feed water heater, the two streams will combine into one. And this is where the saturated liquid would be leaving. So for our steam, of course, we're given the mass flow rate of 0.865 kilograms per second already. And we're also given its enthalpy of 2763.5 over there. Same thing for our subcooled liquid. This is HF1 given here. 0.5 kilojoules. And of course the enthalpy of our saturated liquid also here x97.22 kilojoules per kilogram. So this is a simple case of conservation of mass or conservation of energy. So we have our steam going in, that is simply m sub s multiplied by h sub g. And our water is also co going in mw multiplied by hf1 and then we have the saturated liquid um, leaving the open feed water heater since the two streams combine we can simply say that m sub s plus m sub w is the total mass that's leaving the feed water heater and of course multiplied by by the enthalpy uh, right here. So now it is a simple case of a substitution. You can probably see where we're going. This becomes a simple case of shift solve. And uh, there we have the mass flow rate of our subcooled liquid. Mw is equal to 3.021 kilograms per second. But let's not forget that we still have the heater efficiency here. So we actually need to get Mw prime. So all we need to do is multiply uh, what we found here by our heater efficiency, 0.95. And there we have it. Mw prime is equal to 2.869 kilograms per second. And that is our final answer. I hope this helped. 
consider liking, subscribing, and following me on Patreon. Thanks and goodbye.